Hey everybody, this is GliderCat and it's time to play. We're back in Shapes 2. Let's get cracking on the next milestones and objectives here. Got a little warning here. Let me just fix it. Uh, what's going on here? I think there's just a this little belt. This needs to be like that to be happy. All right. What's next? Let's go for... Um, let's go for this guy way at the bottom. We have our two vortex objectives are being worked on. That's usually the highest priority. That's all in motion. Let's do this one at the very bottom. We need 560 and we just need to pin another circle onto an existing shape. Um, but that shape is probably already stacked pretty high. Where are you? This guy. Just needs one more circle on top. Uh, that's not going to be a problem. I think that's going to be a problem. I think we can put our stackers right here. Uh, maybe not. Yeah, it's got to be one more out, I think. Belts on the ground floor just to send those forward. Then we'll just share these circles here and go up. And then our output belt. Just as that. I think that's all we need for that one. Find out here in a second. Yeah. Circles on top of that other shape. One thing playing this game, it's always hard to give these shapes names. I don't know if they have names. Oh yeah, it does have a name. It's Kuru Kuku 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 Kuku. Silly me. Should have uh should have remembered that. Yeah, it's always hard to describe them when we're talking about these shapes. It's a circle with a quarter circle on top of a diamond looking thing. Alright, that is in motion. Uh, we've got something to claim here. Ooh, that was good for six tech points. Let's look at the upgrade tree again. Um, there was a hint at the end of last episode or a tip that popped up that said we can send items into the vortex on elevated belts. So what that means is over here, I can send items through up a level too. Like if we had a belt up this way, those would be able to go into the vortex also. Right, so we can leverage these ports at least three floors. We haven't unlocked the third floor yet. I'm not sure if there are more floors after that. That's kind of cool. I think. We'll have to keep that in mind when we're hurting for space to get things into the vortex. And as we expand the factory, I imagine that's going to be a problem. All right, what's next? This guy with the little blue square on top of the white square, I want to do once this objective's done. That one's super slow. We need 2,000. Should we maybe even think of just amping this one up? Anything we can do to make this guy a little more productive? That belt's not super saturated like at all what could we do not much unless we set up our own separate production line with just two and two uh, let's leave it we'll focus on other tasks in fact and yeah, we'll focus on other tasks I guess get a new one to claim do it Oh man, look at that thing. Could do... Let's do these two. It's going to be... It's going to be slow. Two with a red. If we can do it. Two pointies. The red. Uh, we may be making use of this platform for this one. All 
right, let's think about what we want to do. This guy, we want to take out the left side. We don't need that at all. We're going to have to rotate. Yeah. That's the piece we kind of want. Next step. We need to share some of these. Um, these ones are going to go on. And then this set, we need to cut off. The, we need to cut off the red, right? Yeah, we need to cut off the red. They print to a bar, okay. It's gonna be a rotate. Cut. Except I want the other rotate, I think. That gets me my little extra pointy guy. And this one, I think we want it. Just thinking how we're going to rotate this. I rotated that. That guy could just slap right on top. So let's do it. Let's move this out. Mm, thinking. It's this, right? Oh, uh, we can empty these belts. Oops, not like that. Uh, empty the belt is I. Yeah, now our Okay, yeah, now now things are different. <laughs> now things are different. Okay. Okay, okay. This slice. Shoot, shoot, shoot. And those, I think, need to just be dropped on top of this and we're good to go for this shape. Okay, so let's do and okay, then up frost. And down below, these guys just come straight on underneath. And stackers, as usual. I think the production rate is going to be a little on the slow side for these. We're going to have to scooch those guys over above us. Which means we're gonna have to do that. Ah, uh, just going into the vortex over there. We'll figure it out once we get over there. Is 
that us? That is our shape right there. That's this guy down here. That'll do. Uh, this one. What did I do? Did I just mess something up? I'm confused. This one, I guess we're done with this one? <laughs> I'm confused. I'm confused. Yeah, this was the old shape we were sending across, right? And that one is done. All right. Let's, um, let's turn that into something, too. That was this mess. These guys down here. What about doing this thing? Let's, uh, let's delete all this so we lose our minds. This time we want just two of the pointies next to each other. What's the quick way to do that? Make me rotate. We'll start that. We'll send these across. Maybe that's what we had. I don't remember. You, these fellows need to find a work area. And I need to fix this over here. I'm gonna have to move this. Oh, 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 I should be stacking, right? I was just talking about that. Let's do that. Anchor there, and you head up that way. How's that? I think everybody's got a belt to call home. Um, escape. Where did this belt? All right, back to it. These little fellers over here, we want to send across the way, I think. Let's kind of do a little production line like we did over here. Okay, the next thing we're going to need to do with these guys is rotate them. Like that. The other way. I think, and then slicey dicey. That's what I want. That's what I want right there. I don't know if six is the right number. I'm just, just random for me. Do the calculations. If you'd like, I'm not going to bother. All right, these guys, we want half of these. These are going to move on. You guys get to move on. You guys get processed some more. Just need to rotate a tiny bit. And I don't have room to put stackers over here yet. You guys can just carry on. You guys come over here, come down. Up, up. Like this. Beltage. Here's. I don't know that we can stack on these. 
send multiple levels. We can try it just for the heck of it. Try and go up. I think it's just going to share the belt. Here's our shape. Let's see what, <laughs> let's see what happens. I'm get yeah, I'm guessing they'll just share the belt, which actually they can, because there's a bunch of extra room on this. There you go. Oh, it says vortex limited. We'll see what happens when those make their way across. And take a second for them to get here. We've got something to claim. Let's do it. Boom. That's good for six research points. We're making our way through these tasks. I like it. Upgrades. We've got 26 points. What do we want next? Our text inputs we're getting away with. Zacker speed would be a big deal for us. I think that's probably worth it. Take that one. Let's see. Yeah, let's invest a little in speed for now, and then we'll save the rest of our points. Still not super interested in that yet. Labels will come once we get really big, big factories. E shape the foundations are going to be important too. Wires, wires, signals, filters, readers, displays, and buttons to automate your factory even more. Oh man, logic stuff. Logic gates. Not sure if we'll get into that. I don't know if my brain can uh, work through that when I'm trying to have fun. All right. Vortex objectives are underway. This guy should be on its way. Our little two pointy guys be coming along here. Sharing a belt with these guys. Hopefully we'll see him. Yeah, it's showing that they're there. They're stuck. Yeah, it shows them, but they're not moving. I'm not sure what that's trying to tell me. Blue ones are definitely moving. These guys are not. These aren't really launching. I thought they were, but they're not actually launching. Must not be able to, right? All right. Well, we tried it. Might work. I just don't know how to do it. Um. So let's rip that up. We'll just send these guys next door. Boom. Then we need to make sure we have a path to the vortex from that belt, which we don't have yet. These guys come up. If we want. Put them, send them along here on top of this path just for the heck of it. Now let's see if they're making their way onto the belt. Guessing they probably are. Now they're moving. This one has a memory of the old part, but maybe that'll go away. That's all moving. That's all moving. Uh, and that has nothing on it yet. What's next? We get a new objective. Mm, let's see. I want to see what we're sending again. Hmm. I'm looking at this. We need a blue square with a red circle on top. I thought we just had something just like that. 
Here's a red circle. We need a blue square. I don't think I want to assemble that from little tiny pieces. Urgh. that or is that just for looks I think that's these aren't actually shapes right maybe they're places we can build platforms or something or, or maybe they're paint not sure I don't think we have the ability to do paint stuff yet look at the upgrade tree for that Fluid tank stores excessive fluids. Air extension. Trains allows you to build green trains and rails. Must be different speed trains or something. The train stuff. What about just basic liquids? Painting. Level one. We uh, fluids and painting. Yeah, we're working towards it. We've got one more. Objective they're going to make us do before they let us be painting. That's this guy here. We need 8,000 of them. Oh, man. That's going to be so slow if we're just assembling it from quarters. Oh, we're still doing our little blue halves. Oh, boy. Um, hmm. Thinking, thinking, thinking of how we want to do this. I mean, we could set up more extractors over here. Right, and have a whole new platform and route resources. We can do blue squares. In fact, we can do both off of this. It's just going to be not super efficient. We need 8,000. Let's go for it. Let's just, just dive into this. It's going to be a little challenging, I think. A shape miner, not that way. Do our extensions. You, you. Uh, don't know that extensions can feed each other. I think they can. Hey, okay. oh look. Yeah, we got four. So we're gonna pull off the. I can't, oh man. Do we want to make the red circles out of this? I suppose we could. So we can pull off the red quarter circles, send them off to one side, pull off the blue little square, send them off to another side, do all the assembly, pitch the little pointy guy. Man, we don't need a platform. How do we want to do this? Let's see what we can do. See what we can figure out here. Uh, we'll start with the blue squares. We're going to have to think about both. So we're going to want to slice and keep everything. Just thinking, I'm going to work this space wise. Oh man, I think I can do it up here. How can I pull this off? Send the shapes over here and start working on them. Or we have more room or is there anything I can achieve here? Or I 
thinking it'd be nice to leverage this space, but I don't think there's a good way for me to do it. Clear a way. Uh, let me think for a minute and I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. I have an idea. I don't know if this is going to work. And this is kind of goofy. Let's take these shapes. And them out here. These are all unprocessed shapes. And we'll do the same thing with this guy. There may be some teardown in this as we experiment. In fact, be something already I can do. It's more sense. We can extract to this other direction. And that saves me a little bit more space. Same thing with you fellas. Send you this way. And you come across here. Then now with these guys, can I pull off some initial processing? Something. Just uh experiment. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Something like that. Encroaching. And then these little guys. Oh man, this is going to be a little crazy. There's the blues. The blues. Here's the other ones coming out. I don't think I can do this for all these guys. I'm trying to see what I'm trying to do, but maybe this just isn't going to work. I'm going to flood these belts. Yeah, I think. Oh man, there's a clever way to use the space, but more over here. Can't quite get. I think not do this. <laughs> tried, tried, but I just don't think that's going to work. All right. So let's send everybody else over kind of normal style. Uh, we want extractors. Happen. Oh, I see it. Zoom me. Oh, no, 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 no. Bad. Guys. That. You guys already have it. Yeah, I was hoping we could make use of this space, but I guess it's not urgent. Now we got to divide all these guys up. Boy, I maximize this. It's going to be slower. Boom, 
needs to be rotated, destroyed. Those guys can find their way onto a belt and be assembled into circles. And these guys can do the same thing. These ones can go up. I want to shift that all the way back. Thinking, thinking, thinking. Take all of that here. Copy you and put you up one, maybe like that. Second batch. And then we've got two more batches. Let's see what we can come up with. I'm trying to do something kind of creative here. was a flip, shift flip. Then these guys, we may reroute these belts. Not sure how this is gonna play out yet. Doing this for the challenge, it may not be practical. Two, three, four. Take these guys to start with. Oh man, I don't know. I don't know. Production's pretty slow, right? Turn these into halves. Guess we could maybe combine these all. Oh, it's because I'm not making use of the other halves yet. Oh man, how am I going to do this? You're down. Go here now. See where I'm going with this, right? Uh, not like that. Make these look consistent. Here I'm thinking of assemble, trying to assemble circles. But here I'm assembling the little blue squares, right? We need a red circle on top of a blue square. For these guys, I need to rotate to share these, right?
these guys come up. These guys are going to get shared. Whoops, not up there. Pretty you down. Guys. And be shared. This can stay down. And then these ones. Need to rotate again. Hmm. See where I'm going with this, I think. We got stackers. I think that would do it. Let's um let's clear this belt. Maybe that'll help. Okay. We get to see a little bit more production happen. Clear this stuff out. Now the blues are backed up. get blue squares out of here that is the question there they are blue squares right oh man this is crazy i think i'm gonna need more platforms to pull this off Let's see about the circles <laughs> circles these are all gonna get Gonna be shared. We might end up with slow production just for the space. I don't know that I can leverage all this stuff. Put off. These guys are going to have to come forward too, actually. Um, maybe not. In fact, I don't think I need those. I can put my stackers in. Nice, come up. I get this our bottom halves. I don't think I can make use of all this. These guys shared again. I do a 360 rotation on the need 
directly into a stacker. And you guys can just hop on up. Whoops. On up into that. There, I'll put belt. Up top. Here's your output belt of circles. Yeah, I'm not really making use of everything here. That belt's already saturated. Quarter circles. Maybe we could do another platform over this way. You need 8,000 of these. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I got my circles and I got my squares. I think these are stackers down. It's on the first floor. These guys can find their way over. And drop on top. I think... We have our part. It's just our shape. It's just, um, man, it's taking up way more space than I was hoping. That little warning. Okay, there they are. Oh, man, I wouldn't call it easy. These are saturated. I could extend the platform. Oh man. Do I have room? I do have room over here, actually. I could leverage those belts. Hey, what? Let's leave this episode here. I'm going to look at this between episodes a little bit. And think about if we want to expand this production. I think this is going to be pretty slow for 8,000. I'd love to have a saturated belt. If, um, I mean, we could always wait, just do other things, but I kind of want to do it for the challenge. Let's see if I can get a saturated belt of this shape before we have the paint controls. I think once we get paint, it's going to be easier. Yeah, I'd like to scale this up. I may do a little work between episodes to make that happen. Probably add a platform. If I can make use of at least one or two more of these tape deposits. Yeah, that's it for this one. For analysis of the Ladder Cat saying thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this series on Shapes 2. Very cool game. Similar, but very, very advanced from the original Shapes. Oh man, as I mentioned before, this game has inspired so many kind of similar games, almost its own subgenre of factory games. Don't have to worry about building materials, you just you just play, man. You just build factories. Love it. Hope you do, too. I want to thank Gladder Cat patrons and channel members for their support. Deeply appreciated. And with that, I'll see you all in the next one.